Yo, how's it going? I am at Coyote Creek for three reasons. One, today's opening day for fishing at Coyote Creek. Two, the weather's cloudy. It even rained a little bit. That could make for better fishing. Three, that weather's gonna keep most people away. There's nobody here. <laughs> Only the true fishermen like myself and you will come on a day that's a little bit chilly to catch fish. I'm here, I'm gonna catch fish. Just got back from New Maloney's a few days ago. I'm still fired up to fish. Let's do this. I am prepared. Fill the thermos up with water. The worst thing is running out of water when you're fishing. Take that. Okay, I've got one rod. It's Texas rig for now. Split shot rigged, actually. I've been doing that a lot. And my backpack. One Plano box with a bunch of crap in it. Everything from crankbaits to jerk baits, beetle spins and uh, grubs, a couple full size spinner baits, I think. Maybe one anyway. I gotta make sure my hooks are barbless because you have to be barbless at Coyote Creek. And I have one small tackle box with terminal stuff in it hooks, weights, swivels, blah, blah, blah. Right in the center. Oh. There's somewhere. Oh, got one. Oh. I'm not sure. Could have been a bite, could have been a stick. Let's see if it happens again. Oop, there's a fish. You didn't get it though. That's why I'm right next to it. Okay, we're here. We got a bass. There's a fish. That's a bass. I don't know if you guys can see that, but the bass just came out from that log or under that gunk and Shot out to check out my bait and then kept going. I'm gonna throw one closer to that log. See if there's another one in there. So slow. Okay, there we go. There it is. Come on, get it, get it. Got it. Oh, dude, I had him, I had him. I just had my first bite. I had that fish, dude. I should have landed him. I should have been a little more patient, I think, and let him. Right in front of him. No, nope, he was he's ignoring it. He's going back under cover. Okay. He lives under there. Right under. Right under there. Hmm. Starting to get a little more treacherous. Not one. Not one. Come on, get up. Get up here. Don't go under there. That's pretty good size. Yeah, he is. Shit, I gotta get him out of here. Hold on. Stay in the water. Yes. 
First Coyote Creek Morgan Hill Bass of the Year 2021. That's a nice large mouth. I'd say at least two pounds. You know, I'm gonna weigh them. Let's give them away. I haven't weighed one yet this year. All right, it's 1.7. All right, that's all I want to know. Sorry, dude. 1.7 pounds. Coyote Creek. Opening day. Pretty good. All right. Get them in the water without dropping them like we did last year. Okay, huh? Let's um, put you over here with these other big guys. Mark. Oh, there you go. Right on. I got one uh, Morgan Hill bass now. Pretty good one. 1 1.8 pounds. That 1.8 pounder was pretty fat. I think it's a pretty good chunk for. Uh... Oh, got one. Ah, I had to have been a bite, dude. That might have been a bed in the house. Oh, got one. I got one. Oh, I missed it again. Something's biting it. Pink, 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 pink. <laughs> Definitely bites. Probably just too small to get it. Let's see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just about had it. I had the worm, didn't have the hook. Okay, not bad. Um, caught a fish. Hooked up with one other one and um, just <laughs> messed with a whole bunch of spawning or a couple of spawning fish. Uh, not bad. First day at Coyote Creek, whatever day today is, last uh, Saturday in April. Uh, cool, looking forward to better things. Once these fish are done spawning, they should spread out and uh, start um, making all those fishermen really happy. So cool, man. Glad I came today. It's been a good. Um, week went to new maloney's for four days got some spotted bass came here today caught a couple of largemouth cool seasons just get going so get your gear together and let's go fishing yeah